it's, it's just so shocking and so hard to come to terms with. And I think I'm still processing all of this. I don't think we've taken much time to grieve. This is the first step in the grieving process. The thing that was amazing about Dr. Rabinowitz is he was our friend as well as our doctor. He took the time to you know, really talk to us as, as people and not just as patients. It's hard for me to imagine what, he was, what was going through his head and through everybody's head when this happened. We're hearing that maybe he went in to help, you know, that he might have been helping people try to get out when this happened, and that, that sounds like him. So I just want to show my respect in, in the moment that I had. So that is, that is why I did what I did. I felt that it was proper to, to show those respects rather than just drive past and, and not acknowledge something like that. I think this is gonna be one of the great moments that we show that we stand up taller and we come back stronger than what we are. We're all grieving. We all love this place and we all love this neighborhood and I definitely loved Dr. Rabinowitz. We stand quiet until it happens to our own city and so we need to stop being quiet.